Today I am going to be germinating some golden beet seeds. So all I have done right here is wet a paper towel, spread all of my seeds out in it, and now I'm going to fold it in a way that I can get it in this plastic bag so that it will stay wet and germinate the seeds. Seal up the bag to hold in all the moisture that you can. Then just put it in a warm place to germinate. Today is February 20th. So it's been exactly seven days. Oh, look at that. Nice. Wow. Okay, so I have moved outside and I'm going to try to separate these into individual seedlings and get them planted in this. That's my 72 cell seed starting tray. So the reason we separate these a little bit is because that is one seed pod right there and there are multiple in some of those seed pods. So once I get all of these loose, I have some more under this side, I'm going to take them and put them all in the seed starting tray. So I'm going to go ahead and show you how I'm going to do that. So I'm literally just going to take this little seedling, let me zero in on one of the cells. And I'm just going to barely, barely insert it into the dirt leaving the little green part up and the little yellow part is the root and if I get one that is super small and doesn't have much of a root I can bury more of it and the green will continue to grow up out of the dirt so just cover it up it doesn't matter if you even cover up the whole thing because the green part will grow up and the roots will grow down. So stick them in there the best you can. So this particular soil that I have in here, I just have some regular um, raised bed mix that I have put in the bottom for nutrients. And then the top, I have just used a seed starting mix. When they are stuck together like that, I just gently pull one out. Look at those. Those have really gotten far along. Look at that.
And that's it. I've got one in every cell. Now I've watered these really well and I'm going to put them back on the heating mat. Now here they are the next day. You can see they're already starting to look better. Now I'm going to scoot this tray back and use this heating mat to germinate some other seeds. I'm just going to put them on top of the mat and slide the tray back on top of them. Now here we are 13 days later. Look at all that growth. Don't they look fabulous? They're just beautiful.